Good morning, everybody. This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Caps to beside you, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, apply. everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. You guys are just a bomb.com. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart chakra. Um, we're at 11,615 subscribers right now. So, love you guys. 11,615. Love you. Uh, let me get my kitty some food. I think he has some, but he's scratching at the bag. So, give me just a second, okay? Okay, so sorry. Ooh. I hope everybody is doing well. I do, I do, I do. Who's sorry about that? They had food, but I got them so wet. So that's how we're rolling. Um, okay, so this is daily tea for today, uh, for Saturday, March 19, 2022. Um, I been up for not very long just a little bit but um my my own are still sleeping so um very excited about getting the day started off uh with them but i was going to come in here and do a reading for you guys um so i was sitting in here chillaxing with the kitties and then and meditating and i got a channel so i'm going to deliver it I hope everybody is doing well. Okay. Um, oh, I was going to tell you guys. Um, I'm considering, I have been getting so many requests, um, especially this past week or so, past week or two, about um, personal readings. Uh, question after question about question, um, please can I get a personal reading? I mean, a lot of them. So I consider I have considered reopening them back. I can't speak. Reopening them back up is not even Mercury retrograde. Um, I've considered reopening them back up. So, um, it's my weekend this weekend. So, I was thinking about doing it tonight after my own go to bed. Okay. Um, that's what I think I'm going to do tonight. Um, it might be a little late for some of you guys. I know some of you guys are different, in different countries and some are in different, way different time zones like mountain and, um, uh, Pacific and all that, all that. So, I mean, you're probably going to be hours off of mine. So hopefully it'll work out for you. Um, it won't be so late is what I'm trying to say. Um, but that's my game plan tonight, possibly. Um, I, I think I'm going to, but I'm going to wait till they go to bed. So I'm thinking 10 PM tonight, central standard time. I'm thinking, but I'll do an official, uh, an official video when I officially decide to open them up. I just wanted to throw, um, throw that out there real quick before we get started. Um, I think this is what I'm going to do, though. But it won't be until 10 p.m. Central Standard Time. So whatever time zone you're in, um, just if you're interested in doing that, just um, kind of look at my time zone and your time zone and see if it works for you. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Um, and maybe next time, okay? But I think that's what I'm going to do. Okay, so, um, but I'll make an official video. Okay. All right. So the channel message I received was, um, sorry. Ooh, okay. Okay. So the channel message I received was, um, many karmics are going to start experiencing huge money losses soon. I heard some of them are extreme gamblers. Um, and they are about to experience huge money losses. Some of them, um, theft by family members. Um, you plug it in, hot oh, and some theft by lovers, 
Yeah, I heard that one too. So you plug it in how it resonates. So um, if this isn't you, it could be somebody you're connected to. I just want to throw that out there. Um, it's who I'm picking up on in the universe. So um, for those of you new, which I've had a lot of newbies recently, um, if you're new to the spiritual realm, um, new to tarot, period, period, um, the stories I pick up on in the readings, if it doesn't resonate with you, you got to let it fly, okay? Um, just to let you know, okay? Not every reading is going to be for you. It's not a personal reading. Um, these aren't, okay? So, and of course, you're welcome to view them and watch them, absolutely, but you have to plug yourself in where you fit if you do. If you don't, then you're welcome to watch it or you can click off, okay? Um, just saying. Um, okay. I know I was a little annoyed in one of the videos the other day, and somebody sent me a text and told me that. They said, man, you're you're kind of cold and annoyed, but it's what that person, and I explained to that person, and we were cool after that, but what they didn't understand is that I got about 50 texts. It doesn't resonate with me. It doesn't resonate with me. It doesn't resonate. I mean, on every single one of my videos, I've been saying for two years, if it doesn't apply, let it fly. So it gets kind of annoying. <laughs> and that's just the truth. So, yeah, I was a little annoyed. So I wasn't trying to be cold. I wasn't trying to be, you know, rude. But, you know, people have got to understand that. They have to understand that. I mean, my gosh, I've been on it for two years. If you listen to the disclaimers, you would, you would know. And that's just the truth. So, yeah, it was annoying. You know, I mean, who wouldn't? Who wouldn't be? And I'm just being for real. Okay, so yeah, so I digress, but I'm serious. So somebody um, is a bunch of karmics, apparently. Like I said, it could be you or somebody you're connected to, but a bunch of karmics are about masculine and feminine energies. Masculine and fem energies is what I just heard, masculine and fem energies. So masculine and fem energies, uh, apparently, and um, they about to experience huge money losses. Um, they're karmic energies, so they do not put positive out to the universe towards others. Um, no honesty, trust, respect, integrity, loyalty, etc. Um, and it's kind of like karmic, I mean, karmics to people are people that mean ill will to others. Um, uh, and they usually do it through stinky, shisey, manipulative tactics, uh, a lot of times. Um, and I'm serious. Um, uh, I mean... And that's just the truth. They're not usually very direct about it. They usually go about it in very sneaky, shisey, behind the scenes tactics. And that's just the truth. But whoever these people are, some of them are very highly influential. Okay, I heard some of them are very highly influential. Okay, so some masculine, some feminine energies, and some of them are very highly inf inf influential. So they're high on the totem pole in the community or the world, um, basically. Um, there's karmics that are in high positions of high authority in the world, and there's karmic uh, people that aren't karmics. Um, are you high vibrational or are you low, basically? Um, karmic energies are low vibrational, free mind doesn't know. High, high vibing people are not karmic energies uh, for people who don't know. So, yeah, so, so the karmic energies, they're low vibing, and some of them are highly influential and some are masculine and feminine energies and basically they're about to start losing a hell of a lot of money basically some of them have the money to lose it sounds um sounds like some of them i heard it's by family members theft by family members some it is um what was the other one theft by fa family members there was three of them theft by family member or members um oh theft by lovers so you know, somebody they're sexually connected with, either in a committed relationship or not. And there was another one. There was a, a third one. Theft by lover, theft by family member, and then something, uh, whatever the third one was, you can go back and check it. Um, but a lot of theft there, a lot. So, um, but it sounds like it's negative karma for them because whatever they're doing, putting into the universe, apparently is not very positive. Um, so, or they're either putting negative into the universe or it's karmic debt that they're paying from the past. Um, however that resonates, um, however that resonates, I mean, everybody's situation is different. So you have to plug these people in, how they resonate, if they do resonate in your life. If it's not you, it could be somebody you're connected to. 
We have gift reversed. You can't make this crop up even if you wanted to. Gift reversed, number 17, could be a very significant number in one's life, number 17. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number, number 17, gift reversed. Some are about to lose stolen money through a very important case soon. Okay, I heard some are about to lose a stolen, one of these particular karmics is about to lose a, ton, a shit ton of money, basically through a very important case soon. Um, so it sounds like some kind of legal case. Um, but in all fairness, it sounds like they shouldn't even have even had the money to begin with. So um, gift reverse, it's money loss from these karmics, money loss. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. That's really, I mean, it's sad, but you know, I mean, Everybody in life has lessons they have to learn. And that's just the truth. Every single one of us. Every single one of us. Um, I don't care if you make five mil a year or five dollars a year. Um, and that's just the truth. Um, so it sounds like they're about to get um, universal karma here. Um, money loss. Get reverse. Hmm. Spirit messages you have for something. So there's actually, excuse, excuse me, excuse, excuse me. There's actually four cases here. Spirit messages you have for something. House reversed, thief reversed. Number twenty or twenty-four could be very significant numbers in one's life. Twenty or twenty-four. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number, 20 or 24. House reversed. Some are going to experience such huge money money laws that some are going to lose houses, rental homes, vacation homes, some their own home. Oh my gosh. I heard some of these people are going to lose um, such huge money losses. They're going to lose uh, rental homes um, and vacation homes, and in some cases, their own homes. So house reverse is actually physical home loss here um, in this situation. Um, we have gift reverse and house reverse. Um, so, I mean, this is strong. So maybe for some of these people, the rental homes, they maybe they use them for like Airbnb or something like that is what I'm thinking for some of them, or just rented them out in the community. But um, in some of these cases, it's not their home. Um, some of these people are very highly um, affluent, uh, have a lot of money, a lot, a lot, a lot of money. And um, they, uh, so it's not going to be their home in some cases. It's going to be a home they have bought uh, over the years, I'm presuming. And in some cases, it might be several rental homes they lose. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Um, and some, it is uh, vacation homes. And some, it is their own home. So actual physical home loss here, whether it is a home that they do not reside in or a home they do. Thief reversed. It's really going to teach these people some good lessons. Some of these people should have should have uh, learned them a long time ago. Okay, I heard some of these people, it's going to teach them huge uh, good lessons. They should have learned them a long time ago. Some are such huge gamblers. Frequent casino trips. Some of these people are such huge gamblers. Frequent casino trips is what I heard. Wow. So, um, yeah. Money loss, money loss, money loss. I mean, it's about to come huge and it's about to come quick. 
um, rental houses, rental homes, vacation homes, their own homes. I mean, you, they're getting stole from lovers, either for current lovers or past lovers, family members. And there was another one. You'll have to go back and check it. Um, some in legal battles, um, legal cases, it sounds like upcoming in the universe um, that haven't happened yet. And they're about to. Um, at least four categories there. Um, some of them are huge gamblers. I heard frequent casino trips. So, um, you know, they love, they love to gamble. Uh, I'm thinking like Tunica Energy. Uh, anybody doesn't know Tunica, Mississippi, it's a, here in the South, it is a, that's a huge um, place that people go to. It's like a town full of casinos, basically. Um, which I like to go to the casino every now and then, but I budget my money. Um, I budget it. I take a certain amount of money and I stick with that and period. Uh, when I do go, I haven't been in many, many, many years, but whoever this is, um, that particular message is for, they, it's, I feel that they probably have a gambling addiction. Like, you know, you see the disclaimer, like when you go to the casinos, if you have a gambling problem, call the hotline, get some help, like that kind of person. And I'm serious. Um, you know, there's nothing wrong with enjoying things in moderation. Absolutely. But whoever that's for, it's like they've taken it to extremes. And that's just the truth. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard it's going to teach them a huge lesson. So thief reversed. Um, they have, I, I heard they stole in the past. Uh, some, a lot of these people have money they shouldn't even have to begin with. So it's about to teach them a huge ass lesson, basically. Um, not to be a thief. In the past energy, they were that thief upright. They're about to lose it in the form of universal justice, universal karma here. Um, and then we have thoughts reversed. Oh my gosh. Thoughts reversed in great fortune. This is what come out on the bottom of the deck below it, you guys. Number 16 or 26 could also be very significant numbers. 16 or 26, possible ages of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible day birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number, 16 or 26. We have um, thoughts reversed and great fortune reversed. So there's not, not going to be any thought about it. I think it's going to happen quick. Um, when, it, when it does happen, I think it's going to happen quick. I mean, I'm feeling like foreclosure energy or... Um, or um, fast uh, sell your home for fast cash energy um, to try to recoup some of the loss before they completely lose it kind of thing. Um, I mean, I'm serious. I, when, when this happens, it's going to happen quick, I'm feeling. Because um, we have the thoughts reversed. It's going, there's going to be no thought here. Um, the foreclosure companies are probably going to, I mean, they have, you know, that's their job. <laughs> they're, not, they're not supposed to be emotional in this crap. Um, and they shouldn't be. So, I mean, it's going to happen quick. No thought about it. It's going to happen quick. And in some of them in legal cases. So, I mean, I heard they weren't even supposed to have the money to begin with. So, yeah, if you stole the money, you shouldn't have the damn money to begin with. I'm surprised we didn't get the jail card up in here. And I'm serious. And then Great Fortune reversed. I'm about to lose a hell of a lot of, I mean, it's all in the cards and the messages in here. About to lose a hell of a lot of money that these people shouldn't have even had to begin with. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Wow, man, this is something. Let's see. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. Some of these people have been highly influential in their community for years. There's about to be a huge, huge energy shift here. Huge. People are about to, the roles are about to switch and people are about to come into these roles and that they would have never expected. And some are going to be up and these people are going to be down. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so roles, re roles reversing energy, basically. These people are used to being high up in the community. They're used to be, I mean, and they might still be high up as far as like um, 
credentials or degree or job title or what have you. But they're, and I mean, I didn't hear that, but they might be for some. And I feel for some, I'm serious. I think that is the case. But they're also used to being high up money wise. That's where it's about to hit their ass in that freaking pocketbook. We're talking about physical money here, assets, property, et cetera, et cetera. They're used to being great fortune upright. I heard people that are about, uh, it sounds like people in their community that are used to not being um, wealthy are about to strike it big or has just struck, struck it big. And so they're not going to be used to that. They're not going to be used to that. And then their ass is about to be in the poorhouse and they're not used to being in the poorhouse, but it's about to happen. And then people they're not used to being in the poorhouse is about to be um, wealthy or comfortable. So I'm sure it's going to mess with their psyche and it's going to stress them out. Not only that um, they're uh, damn near losing everything, but in all fairness, a lot of these people stole what they had anyways. Um, but people that I feel they might have bullied or rejected or... Um, look down upon is about to is about to come up as far as financial in their community and i think it's going to mess with them mentally because they're used to being top dogs um, but that's something they have to accept because that's just the world that is the world we live in and that is um that's life so i mean if you can't accept that then i mean dear god um this isn't 2022. It's not the world to be living in. And I'm serious about that. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. Some of these people are about to be so, so, so busy in their own life. They have messed with your life for so long that they're about to start experiencing tower after tower after tower after tower in a negative sense. Oh my gosh. You plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so I heard these people, these are karmic people, and I heard that, you know, at the first beginning spiritual message. They're karmics. They were karmics to you, it sounds like, and karmics to other people. It sounds like they bully and berate their way to the top, is exactly what it sounds like. It sounds like they don't do it through hard work, honesty, trust, respect, morals, values. Um, they like to, it's like they use people as footstools to gain their way up financially. I mean, and by theft, I mean, I'm just saying. Um, and it sounds like uni the universe is about to balance this out. Um, and it's, that's just the truth. But, um, but they used you, I feel, as like a footstool in the past. So, um, but I heard they're about to start experiencing such, like, it's, they basically used you in the past, bullied and berated you, I'm feeling in the past, bullied and braided you and probably looked down upon you and maybe slandered you um, um, in the community or to the world or stole from you because there's a lot of physical money loss here, but it's they're not supposed to have it anyways. They stole, I think, from you, just for real, for real, in the past. But um, now that the universe is about to start bouncing out, they're about to start experiencing towers in their own life because it's like the universe is saying it's time for it to happen, basically, um, because they shouldn't have ever done what they did to begin with. Uh, whoever this is for, I'm going to show you power card. Um, in this aspect, it is negative towers because, you know, towers can be negative or positive. In this aspect, it is negative. Um, but in all fairness, these people deserve it. I mean, it sounds like they deserve it. Evaluating the spiritual downloads, it sounds like they deserve it. Um, they've got to learn to, um, their lessons, just like everybody else in the universe. I don't care if you make $5 a year or five mil a year, you have to learn lessons. I don't care. You should never feel better than anybody else. And that's just the truth. I don't care if you make five mil a year or $5 a year. And that's the truth. So I heard tower after tower after tower negatively for them. Um, and it's about to come in the form of money loss, which I think is their worst nightmare here. Because, and I'm serious. Wow. Let me show you. 
this might um for a lot of you guys i feel it was people that used you like they used you to get up to the top or to climb to the top and i'm serious about that I i'm serious so you plug it in how it resonates uh, for some, you could be dealing with a Scorpio or be a Scorpio, possibly. Because um, I heard it's spiritual download, tower after power. So that's Scorpion energy. Um, if you are a Scorpio or dealing with Scorpio, you could have Scorps in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Moon, Hamo, Jupiter charts. You could be a positive Scorpio or a negative Scorpio, depending on what situ uh, which aspect you're in in this situation. Okay? Uh, masculine or femme. You plug it in, how it resonates. Only you know your story, not anybody else. Um, so maybe for some, you could actually be these karmics or you could be somebody dealing with these karmics in the universe, helping to balance it out, possibly. Um, you know, everybody's on different time and life paths, only you know your story, not anybody else. All right, you guys, well, we're done. I hope this helps so much. I'm going to have a wonderful day today. I'm so excited. I feel like that song, I'm so excited. Oh, I just can't hide it. Oh, just saying. All right. I love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful day and namaste.